Two X-Men related key issues and a ghostly debut take the spotlight in this Copper Age report for April 22nd to April 28, 2021. The first of these Copper Keys is a book that introduced a new version of an old character. Ghost Rider 1 was released by Marvel Comics in 1990, the third volume related to this character. The cover artwork was created by Javier Solterez, with Howard Mackey writing the story and Solterez handling the story art. This debut issue of Ghost Rider featured the first appearance of Danny Ketch as the new Ghost Rider, and also debuted a new villain, Death Watch. A high-grade copy of Ghost Rider 1 sold in an eBay auction last week. The book featured a 9.8 universal grade from CGC, a grade given to 332 copies of this issue by CGC. The comic book sold for $504. The next Marvel key issue from the Copper Age is X Factor 6, published by Marvel in 1986. The cover artwork was created by Ron Frentz, while the creative team for the story featured writer Louise Simonson and artist Jackson Geis. The story in this issue of X Factor featured the original team of X Men facing off against a new foe, N Sabaneur, aka Apocalypse. A nicely graded copy of X Factor 6 sold at eBay this past week. The book sported a grade of 9.8 Universal, one of 991 copies of this issue to receive the grade from CGC. This book sold in an auction for $555. The second of the X-Men related books, and the last featured Copper Age key issue, is Uncanny X-Men 266. The book, released by Marvel in 1990, features cover artwork by Andy Kubert, story art by Mike Collins, and a tale written by Chris Claremont. This issue of Uncanny X-Men features the first full appearance of Remy LeBeau, aka Gambit. The Gambit character did appear in Uncanny X-Men Annual 14, which was released before Uncanny X-Men 266, but the story in the annual took place after the story in 266. A graded copy of Uncanny X-Men 266 sold in an eBay auction last week. The book received a grade of 9.8 Universal, one of 2,786 copies to have received that grade from CGC. The book posted a nice sale of $1,507.28.